Welcome back, human beings, to another how to episode here on the channel. We are over on Valgira right now because I needed some more resources, so I went off the island. But basically, I want to be showing you guys today how to get an RG, the best way to get an RG. Um, normally, RG spawn in cliffs and highlands, so as you can see right here, we're in like a mountain, a mountain like cliffy area, and there's an RG down there, there's an RG behind us over there, or a couple over there, and there's also pterodons about. So, what you're going to need for this is obviously some something to knock it out, so either trank darts, or um, we've got the trank darts, or you could use the trank arrows, and also you're going to need four stone gauge, you could probably get away with three, and you could do this with behemoth if you want to do behemoth. Um, but stone gates probably easier to manage around so you just want to spread these out a little bit Like that and then okay, you want to make sure that you can't get through they can't get through that now I've done this a little bit too far So I'm going to pick up this last one and we're going to try replacing it. Obviously if you're not on S plus you'll have 30 seconds to Pick that one up. Is that a bit better? Oh, we need to go a little bit more So basically you want to make it so you can walk through the gap in the gate but not too big that the RG could fly through. Okay, that's perfect. So you've got enough room to walk through, but they shouldn't have enough room to get out. And then you're going to have two gates moving there. Depending on which way you're going to lead the RGs, I'm going to shoot one from over there and run in like this. So we're going to put a gate on this back one, and we're going to keep the other gate in our inventory ready to go. So this is the way that I find easiest to do this. Now, we should have a scope on us. We do not, but that is fine. We're going to go for that RG right there. So it's right in front of us, nice and easy. And we're just going to shoot it. And it didn't count. Or oh, we might have missed. It could have been either or. Let's try again. There we go. We hit it that time. So now this RG is going to be running straight at us. And the whole idea of this is that we're going to lead it into the trap. Let's just probably fire one more warning shot or at least a dart at it. Okay, that didn't count. I was going too high. So we're going to run in with this. We're going to get the door ready. And then when it's in here, we're going to just place the door. Bam. And then we're out. Easy as that. That RG is stuck in there now. And we're going to start pelting it with darts. It's a 156. So it's actually a pretty decent level. Um, you don't want to do this with wood gates. Because obviously they're able to hit the wood gates. But while we're knocking this out. Let's talk about uh, what you can use to tame this guy. So obviously it's a meat eater. So you could use raw meat. Um, I'm, I'm not going to say every single one. Because you can obviously use cooked variants. But they're just not as good. So you could use raw meat, you could use raw prime meat. Raw meat will give you a 23% effectiveness on the tame. Uh, prime meat will give you a 73% effectiveness, which if it was a 180, you'll probably be getting about 55 levels out of that on top of the level. Um, raw mutton will give you an 81%, which is obviously amazing. And if it was a level, if it was level 150, you'd be at level 210. Um, so this one will be a little bit over 210. And then, if you've got superior kibble, which is the obviously the best thing to tame these guys, you want to use that. So obviously, there we go. That's knocked out really easily. Um, superior kibble will give you a 95% tame, which is 71 levels, which is awesome. We do not have any of the good stuff. We're just going to put in normal meat. That's going to start taming up. Obviously, if you're on S+, plus, you can, on PC, you could take this contraption back down just by using one of the guns. So right here, we've got one of the guns, and you could just... Take this down, or you can just leave it here as a permanent trap to try and get arges, especially if you're trying to get high levels. Now, that trap will work with snow elves. Um, pterodons, not so much because they don't fly after you, so you have to just bowl with them, and a few hits will knock it out. Uh, but definitely, um, you, for griffins and stuff, you, and wyverns, you're going to need, obviously, the behemoth gates. Not that you can knock out... Well, you can knock out wyverns, sorry, but you wouldn't be taming them. You're just getting it for the milk. But that trap works for pretty much all flyers. Um, and there we go. That was like the easiest way to do it. And you want to use either raw mutton or superior kibble. If you don't have either of them two, use prime meat. And at the very least, if you don't have that, just use regular meat and you should tame it. There we go. That's it for guys. Hopefully you've enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to hit the like button. Subscribe to become a human being. And I'll see you in the next one. Have a fantastic day. Peace.